Hello all. How are you? Well, this is my 11th video, I guess. In this video, we will check uh, if there are any root kits or trojans or any sort of any vi virus are there in our files or not. To do that, we will use mainly two tools. First is RK Hunter and uh, second is CHQ root. That is for uh, that is uh, check root maybe whatever. Uh, so, sorry, CHQ root kit. Um, those two will check if our computer is, is infected or not and that is very important so this will be a short video let's get started uh, first tool will be RK Hunter um, I will simply use the command RK Hunter space minus minus check to uh, use that tool or you can use RK Hunter minus minus help for more options anyway I am logged in as root um, so I will run RK Hunter minus minus check. This will simply check my all the files and every modules and whatever installed in my PC. Okay, do it a second. I'll start. Okay, mm. yeah, start it. Checking the files and it says okay, okay. Oh, wait, there was a warning. You need to sort that out. Anyway, this is uh, RK Hunter, I guess. And uh, this is going fine. Next tool we'll see is CHK root kit. Anyway, uh, press enter to continue. It's checking again. Now it's checking the warm and root kits, etc. Okay, I will good this process by pressing control C now I will use uh, chk root kit for that you have to first navigate to slash pen test slash forensic slash ch chk root kit now simply run dot slash chk root kit ok I pressed enter not infected not infected you can see telnet d time not found not infected so let it finish and it will, it will tell you whether your computer is infected or not Finally, it will uh, searching for me first log. It may take a while, whatever. I don't care. I know my computer is not affected, definitely. Again, I'm quitting this. Control C. So, uh, this was all for today. And in next videos, we'll cover some more exploit. And yeah, I'm thinking to cover beef. That is browser exploitation framework. That's pretty cool. Okay, anyway, see you guys. Bye-bye.